Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a NOR logic gate. NOR being not A or B. So before we begin, or before we continue, I'll show you how to what the truth table is. So you have two inputs A and B, and output X. And for all combinations of possible inputs, unless A or B are low, sorry, A and B are low, you get uh, you get a high. Everything else is low. So when uh, a or B are high, you get a low, or A and B are high, you get a low. This is the circuit symbol for a NOR gate, so you have two inputs A and B, and output A or B not, so it's A NOR B. Uh, once again, this, this circle symbol is, is a NOR, or is a, is, is a NOT, so I'm NOTting an OR gate to make a NOR gate. Now this direct this video follows directly on from my previous video with the OR gate. So if you want to see how exactly you should build an OR gate or up up to the 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 current stage that I am, you should watch the my OR gate video. So before I continue, I'm going to show you the, the circuit that I built, the OR gate that I built. So here is the circuit, the circuit diagram for my OR gate. Okay, so the points not are here. Is I have a nine volt input, I have zero, I have a zero volt or ground. And then I have an, imp uh, an input transistor A, and an input transistor B, and output over here. So essentially, this makes an OR gate, and this this will say this this uh, LED represents A or B. And what I'm going to do basically is I'm going or yeah I'm going to not this output, so it'll be A nor B. So I'll go back here. So how I'm going to do that is this is the exact same circuit as I built the OR the OR gate. So I'm gonna have the output going into another BJT transistor, into an LED and down to ground. So it's the exact same, it's just I'm putting a NOT gate onto my OR gate. So I've done that, I did I had an AND gate and I put a NOT gate onto that to make an AND gate. So if you want to see how that was done, see my videos on my two videos on the AND gate, see my video on the the NAND gate, or you could also see my video on the NOT gate. So once again, uh, the transistor as uh, transistor I'm using is a BC547, otherwise known as a 2N2222 transistor, and the resistors I'm using are 600 ohms. So here is the here is the the OR gate that I built in a previous video, the exact same OR gate. So what I'm going to do is modify this and put a, na a, a NOT gate onto the output of that. So points to note are here. Here's transistor one. Here's transistor 2, here's input B, here's input A. And if you remember, the output of that transistor came out of this yellow wire here. And what I did is I had an LED in here signifying the, the output. So this point on my circuit is this point here on my circuit diagram. So what I'm going to do is put a transistor in here and to knot that. So here is my usual transistor. Very quickly again, you have a flat side as left as you see it, and a rounded side on the right. So as you face the flat side, you have collector, base, emitter. Okay, the left side, the flat side, always be facing to your left as you look. So, in these videos anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my transistor in series with this this line here, and I'm also going to put the collector of that through the resistor up to high. So the this red wire here is from the high line and I'm going to put in a resistor in series in that into the collector. Okay, just to show you what I've done so far. Okay, so here was the output of uh, my OR gate. It's going up to the base of my third transistor. The collector is through a resistor to high and the emitter is grounded. So, so far what you can see is the output going into the base, the resistor from high going into the collector, and the emitter grounded. So now what I'm going to do is put an output here from the resistor at the collector down to ground. Okay. So this wire, red wire here is coming from the emitter, wrong, the collector of my final, um, my, 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 not, my not gate. 
So I'm going to put an LED in series with that, going to ground. So it's time to check the truth table on my NOR gate. Remember, just to go back over my NOR gate, you had A and B and X. So what I should get is that for every combination of my inputs, I should get a low, except when both inputs are low. So look, A and B are low, and I'm getting a high. A is high, B is low, and I get a low. A is low, B is high, and I get a low. And when A and B are low, I get a low, thus confirming the truth table. And that is how you make a NOR logic gate.